my daily heroes reset, but I really don't want to play that crap yet. I am well pleased, young Cerebrit. And so long as my prize remains intact, I shall remain pleased. Thus its life and yours shall be made as one. As it prospers, so shall Finally you're back. Yeah, it was gone a while. Maybe took a poo or something or got something Every to eat. <laughs> fail, that flesh shall be made anew. That is my covenant with all Cerebrits. Now you have grown strong enough to bear the rigors of warp travel with the swarm. Thus we shall make our Does he do this to everybody every world and whoever we are Christmas within the hive cluster upon the planet Char. Remnants of the Protoss. What the heck? Just a lumpy this planet skin? Orbit, they will attempt to block our exodus at every turn. My brood shall aid you, Cerebrit, should you require assistance. That is some bizarre stuff. Bring the chrysalis to the beacon. Oh, I'm looking forward to it. Is it so this is like where you gotta bring the psi emitter there? Right, are these the only two of these things I got? Mutating to late? What? What's a layer? Uh, mutate to drones. Wait, I have two hatches. Mutalisk? What the heck? It's an elephant looking thing, but now it's like a flying unit, not a a ground building. Fight the Protoss? Wait, are these my units too? No, they aren't. Are they enemy ones? They're red. Wait, is that really the mission? I just gotta bring it to the beacon, so just pass these guys, in other words. Mission objective. Bring the chrysalis to the beacon. Oh, is this the beacon? There are two. That's weird. Do that if I get close. Do with my minions as you will. Oh. They will serve you unquestionably. Go now and bring swift wrath to all who would oppose the swarm. So they are our units. I feel like this is getting so intense. Here we got 12 of these things. Wait, are hunter killers the same as these guys? I guess they just have double the health. Under attack? Where? Are we really? Oh, by that guy? I didn't even see him. Oh, well there goes our crap. Man, it's just crazy how strong one Protoss guy is. And look how much damage he did to our Hydralisks. Guess I was only controlling our three. The Hunter Killer things don't get commanded when you click on them like the other things do. Double click on them with the rest of them. Okay, I probably need more of these things. So what's a layer exactly? Advanced mutation into a layer. Go to an extractor. We need some Vespine. It's so weird. The ground just so much different. Control group one, you'll be. The flying things are like wraiths. I want to try mutating into a layer once I get enough Vespine. Oops, you didn't mean to click that. So, how early... Like, this is the thing I never understood when I was playing as Terran. Just how early should you attempt to fight at? Like, should I just rush Zerglings right now as fast as I can and just start fighting immediately? Is that like a turret thing? I 
Look at that, I don't mean to. List of Russian dis dishes. The only one I know is borscht, whatever. Easy bait. Probably kill this thing. With that elite Zerg. If the elite one heals enough, make it really easy. Oh, can you get up here? That's gonna take all day. Wait, we're under attack. Oh crap. Oh, bye bye, drones. Dang, how so they come from other directions. What kind of defenses should I make? I don't even know the defensive stuff for the Zerg. Just the like those whatever call it. Whatever they were, like that spore colony or whatever in the Whatever the other one was, I don't even know. Yeah, let's send these things up. Oh, holy crap, this piece of crap spammer. Where should I put these things? We have a crap ton, I guess. Let's put them back and probably the... Well, is this the safest area? It's either the most safe or the least safe. One of the two. There, now I should... Wait, I don't even have any of them working on that. I muted, I mutated the three that were there with the intention of sending them to the extractor, but I completely forgot and just ended up sending them to the <laughs> mineral. Where's... Wait, a mutilisk and a scourge. Okay. A scourge? I don't know what that is. This will figure out soon enough. I plan on building one of everything just to try. How you liking Zerg so far? I like how fast paced it is, but I still just don't know what's the right pace to... Like this... How I didn't know with Terran either. What's... Like how soon should you have an army set up and trying to fight as early as you can or... All that stuff, that's the stuff I really had trouble with. By the way... I think I'm gonna mutate one of these into a, whatever the heck they're called. There's a Hydralisk Den. Oh yeah, and then I mutated those three, planning to turn them into buildings, and I completely forgot to. Borscht is actually Ukrainian. Oh, really? Maybe you should go to Ukraine and have some authentic stuff. Authentic borscht. Let's mutate this one into a... So creep colonies, they are the defenses, right? I just need to figure out how to space them. You can only put them on your nasty ground. How do you get the ground to spread just by having units all around? Bad idea. Where the heck are my hydralisks at? You realize you're a panda? Really? What? What gave it away? What is that thing? Oh, creep colony. They start you off with one. <laughs> nice try. I don't kill my half tree piece of crap. Okay, they sent the whole army here. Man, Protoss are relentless. Let's go with... I don't even have any Zerglings, but let's go with that. Yeah, how do you get this nasty looking ground to spread? Legion, $20 off? What, are you mad that you paid full price for it or something? I have an extractor. Do I want a spawning pool? Is that what this thing is? No, it's evolving. And I guess we want a hydralisk den next. 
And let's mutate some more of these things. Let's mutate this one to do a layer. Whatever the heck a layer is, I don't even know. It's nasty when it's mutated. It's just weird thinking every building is just a, a creature. Make a super cheap army of Zerglings. Okay. Let me just... So a layer. Oh, a spire requires the layer. What the heck is a spire? Yeah, I've heard people say Zergling. Wait, can you mutate him? Oh. Here, I've been finished. I need to see what the spire does. And I need to figure out what defense to set up. So the spore colony that can is so it can only target air stuff and then this can only target ground stuff so you really gotta put a crap ton. Yes, Vicente, do you have any tips on how to play as a Zerg? <laughs> Holy lot of them! Wait, when you mutate it, it makes more than one? Sound they mutated five and it came out with ten. What the heck it do? Oh, please. That is really hack. Did you see the Half-Life 3 or Half-Life Episode 3? I saw Mahendo saying something about it. Send this piece of crap up here by all of his friends. I do like how close together you can get flying units. I hate having everything spaced out so far. I hate how slowly six blue the whole crap with them. I think we have too many of these guys for these. Maybe I should use some of them to build structures. Control group one, you can move over here. Control group two. Wait, no. Control group one, you move off the screen. Then control group two. No, not those. Let's make a few more. Go to Zerg. We have two groups of Zerglings. Half Life 3 cancelled. <laughs> really? <laughs> cancelled? They just cancelled now? Have been mutate piece crap zerglings. You have enough to make hydralisks. I wonder to see how far I can get with just a zergling army. Don't I have do I have the upgrade done for zerglings? Okay, these are hydralisk upgrades. Let's do those, I guess. Because I have all the zerg spawning pool upgrades. Quick. Okay, so all ground. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Let's put one of those. Okay, I need to get back. The, <laughs> the first enemy you come across is an air enemy. So should I do this into a, a spore colony? Because I need some air defense. And how the heck do I get an evolution chamber? Where was that one that I mutated? Did he just go to work automatically? That's why I mutated one. Don't know where I sent him though. Maybe I sent him to his death. Are any of them just AFK? That look like they're doing something. Yeah, I swear I mutated one before I left. Maybe I turned him into something and forgot about it. Oh, I can mutate more. EC. Best way to do this mission, just go straight to the other side with Zerglings on the front. Hydra's in the back. Okay, let me make three more Hydra lists so I can get a full army going. Okay, so let's see what this spire is. Looks really weird. The drones mutate to structures. I just don't know how many creep colonies I need, how much... How many defenses I need to make? Mutalisk requires spires, so that just makes me lets me do these things. Is a mutalisk good or a scourge? I guess I have mutalisks up here. Maybe we should make an army of mutalisks and see how good they are. Let's put them to overlords, and then these ones will be put to. Wait on those ones. Let's just put more of these things around, build some defenses up.
There's, oh, I forgot about the evolution chamber. Where the heck was that right here? Didn't I already build one though? What's the evolution chamber? I guess I don't have one. For some reason I thought I did, I guess not. Mutalists are only good in large numbers if you want to attack with them. Are the... Oh, the Scourger flying bombs? Can I want to try the Scourge? Okay, I think I have enough of the supply depots for now. Do three more Hydralisks, and let's do these ones into... I kind of want to try the Scourge, but if they're just bombs, like, do they blow up and then they're just dead, or do they blow up and then heal and then you can send it back in? Oh, group three. Three other ones that were there, like, that I got for free are different color on this thing. So they explode the gun forever. Well, dang. I don't know if I want that. Let's just keep doing mutalists. I'm really curious to see what an army of mutalists is capable of. I think I need to leave the hydralists back here. Let's go with spore colony for this one. Maybe I should have put the spore colony. Let's do sunken colony here. Yeah, it's kind of bad that you can't send all your SCVs to repair something. You just gotta wait and let it heal on its own. That looks weird. Everything's like the weird triangle elephant trunk deal. Kind of weird looking. There. Get over by your friends. Let's do one more set. Whoopsie. Let's do one more set of Mutalisk. These will be our control group farming. I'm gonna have to, this is going to be the most control groups I've had at once. One, two, three. And then four. And then... Five. Let's just do not a Vespian gas. Crap. I'm gonna wait a sec. Actually, let's do this. Like larva. I think I have enough drones. Let's send a couple of them to harvest Vespian. We're not at peak efficiency right now. There's a brief second of downtime there. I think four is about as efficient as we can get it. There's still a tad. Well, I don't know. Yeah, I guess that's as good as I can get. And the bad thing is, I really have all the structures I need right now. Wait, once you have them gather, you can't have them do anything else? Oh, I guess I have two selected. Okay, let's just send them back to work. There we go, we got our army of these. Control group four. Forces are under attack? From where? Holy crap! Okay, the Mutalists seem fairly powerful. So big it needs its own... Uh, okay. It's not the best thing to keep them in the corner. Well, I was just putting them there because it was far away from every other unit and then I could just build more easily. Okay, so let me put these guys, I guess. We'll kill that thing. I think I'm going to leave the Mutalisks here to defend the base. Because I don't have enough defenses set up to defend it on its own. I need to keep the units behind. Because I only have one Spore Colony and one Sunken Colony. I just don't know how many is a good number. Dang, I lost a Zergling. Oh, I forgot about these things. Okay, so what do you do? Just send these to walk up to an enemy and that's it? Let me try. Oh, that... Unable to attack? Well, then what do you do with it? Oh, <laughs> that's it, really? Okay, let me send out... Actually, let's put these as control group 3. And these as 4. 1, 2, 3...
You're never gonna attack the heavy anti-air stuff. They have something anti-air, it's real small. Overlord? There's a speed upgrade for Overlord? I forgot about the Hydralisk movement thing. Probably do this to flyer attacks. Wait, flyer attacks? Flyer carapace? So wait, then the upgrades from... What was that other deal? This thing. So the they don't all shoot missile attacks. They... Well, now I'm going to need to figure out what the... So I guess these guys are flyers. I guess... So each upgrades for a different unit. So the... These guys shoot spine. So these are... These would be... Which building is it? These would be missile attacks. These guys shoot... Blade worm. It would be this attack. Dang. So yeah, I guess it's not as simple as just upgrading the range attack. You got it for like each type of unit. Same with... Terran, where the flying units have their own set of upgrades and the ground units have their own set of upgrades. Scourge only attack air troops. Um. What the click on? I lost like my whole army already. That thing goes well as I hoped. Probably send these guys back and let them go heal. Screw it. You guys don't have any way to attack us up here. He just runs to the corner of the map. I guess that's nice that everything has a picture so you can match it. You're drinking Coca Cola. Well, congratulate, is it Russian Coca-Cola? So do you have to actually precisely click on a unit, or can you just click near him and it attacks the closest unit? I thought I tested this before, but I can't remember what it... Uh-oh. I think all my troops are going to get killed right here. Actually, none of them died. Well, what the heck? How does that work? Cost a dollar for two liters? Yeah, it's pretty cheap. So I got to bring... Wait, what do I got to bring over here? The Crystallis... Crystallios? Where is the Crystallis? Oh, uh, how do I pick it up? Do I got to pick it up with a drone and send it all the way over? I can probably just run there if I can just get this path cleared. If you just send them to attack, they're not smart enough to know to keep chasing to get their next attack ready. They could probably just walk the thing over. Let's do that, I guess. All the crystals are gone, so I guess that's all that's left to do. You go pick up that little drone. 
Now follow us. You'd be control group two. Oh, I still got my zerglings over here. Okay, you'll be control group three. You guys will be two. I'm surprised we didn't lose any of these guys during that. Okay, let's just clear out a safe path and let that little drone guy follow. Wait, is that one Zerg defense able to attack ground and air units? I kind of like these, whatever these guys are. Mutilus. Don't you dare kill my drone. I know these missions are probably easy just because it's the earliest. Like the second mission only, but still I really like it. I guess they are smart enough to chase. It didn't seem like they were at first. Yes, yeah, so run into a corner. Don't even run back to your own base. We can't walk on that thin little area. I guess we have to clear out a, a new path. Figured it wouldn't be that simple. Maybe I should hurry up and make more of these things. These are probably going to die during this fight. Yeah, holy crap. Holy arm. Our forces are under attack. Oh crap, hopefully this guy doesn't die. Can upgrade an overlord to transport any zergs? Those are the supply things, whatever they were. Or the yeah, dropship. Under attack by what? Oh, that thing. Probably a waste to have all my Hydralis just here AFK defending the base, but they definitely make a strong defense, and since I don't need to worry about keeping them repaired once they heal on their own, pretty nice. That guy's back up to full, too. I should go with them. Two mutilisk armies, two sets of twelve. I don't know, whatever. It seems to be working pretty well. Well, like I think Brood War adds the stuff. Or there's an update later, I don't know. Wait, can you upgrade that this attack with the structure? No, I'm attacking my own structure. I hate that. I click A, and I don't know how to cancel it, so I'm attacking my own building. Oh, in the second. Oh, it's just the chapter. Well, there goes my building.
build two more. I guess I'm gonna go down here. Two more little things of mutalisks, and I have an army of twelve. Too many underlings to create more. Ah, oh, great. Yeah, let's create more overlords. Actually, can these mutate the stuff? No. I could just have these mutate into my defenses. Use right click for single target so you don't accidentally shoot your own units. Yeah, I was A click now. Which screws me over sometimes. Hurry up and make your third larva. Kinda getting hungry. More than the mutilus. Overlords complete! I really like the Zerg stuff. I'm kind of curious to try Protoss. The only thing I worry about is I just... I'm gonna need a good tutorial to explain like how far spaced apart you need the pylons and all that crap. Be Korean? Yeah, that's all it takes. Well, that's definitely how it seems. I don't know why that is. Great mute risk. So we're down in eSport. Like, eSports in Korea is just... I don't know. 1,488 liters of- and how many Mentos? How many millions of Mentos? A whole swimming pool full of it, do the- <laughs> That'd be so funny, just like a giant pool shooting us straight into the sky. It's the dumbest crap ever. There we go, we got our Mutalisk army ready to go. Control group 2 of these guys will be- Where's the guy with the larva? Is that him? Yeah, it looks like he's got a larva on. And then this would be control group four. Let's stack them all up, see how close they can get. Holy crap. Okay, all that and only lost one mutilus. I kinda like that. These early tutorial missions are easy. <laughs> Still took this long though. You could probably just send him right to the thing. <laughs> Hopefully it's safe. The whole path to it. Oh crap. I was not going for that. Yeah, whatever the flying equivalent is of a Kraken. That's what mutalisks are. Holy crap, they're strong. When you have an old, a whole army of it, anything's strong, I guess. Prepare yourself, Sanifrit. Your first jump through warp space could be unsettling. You're victorious! Wow! Protoss forces beaten and scattered. The Overmind has withdrawn the swarms to the remote ash world of Char or Car, whatever the heck. The new Dominion, primary hive cluster planet Chair. Behold the power of that which is yet unborn. For the swirling image. So that chrysalis is gonna be like the, the chrysalis ultimate weapon. Of the sleeper's true power. The sleeper emanations of the chrysalis have reached out into the depths of space and lured our enemies to us. Even now, we are aware of their plans. Oh, this is back when the Confederacy was still. Wait, what? That guy's still alive? 
<laughs> eyes. That, that's how. That's how aliens are. They don't grow full bodies. They just grow single parts. He's just the eye. These guys are just the just the skin flaps and lumps. Okay. I like the Zerg. Times at 10:49. Maybe I'll be done with StarCraft for today. I'll play. Well, I don't know if I'll be streaming tomorrow. Well, if I probably will stream tomorrow. You know what? And if not, I'll be back with StarCraft on crap and Sunday probably. <laughs>